All right, so Apple has released visual intelligence for iPhone 16 devices, and obviously Google has had its own counter to that for a long time in the form of Google Lens. What we're gonna do today, we're gonna take both these devices here and just really put it to a simple test to see speed and accuracy between the two. Now, this is in, by no means scientific. It'll obviously vary depending on your network, where you're at, and all those features. But as far as what they do, this is basically a reverse lookup with visual intelligence. Google Lens will search the internet same way to get that result. Allegedly, the iPhone will be able to point and shoot at a business and give you hours and things like that. We haven't had that work quite yet. Comment down below if you have seen accuracy with those results. But for now, we'll put a couple items to the test on a table, see what recognizes it better, and really go from there. Let us know in the comments down below as well. Do you have a preference or who do you prefer between Google Lens and visual intelligence? Let's go. Okay, so as you can see, we have four assorted devices here from remote to a Peak Design MagSafe accessory to some headphones and then also a different sort of controller, a motion controller for a drone. What we're gonna do, we're gonna launch both these devices. We'll launch Google Lens right now. And then using that new camera button on the bottom here, we'll long press and launch visual intelligence. So let's go ahead and move some of these over for now. And let's go ahead and start with the Peak Design uh, MagSafe accessory because I think it's one that will actually cause it more questions than a quick response. So I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture here. And once you take a picture, you actually have to select what you're gonna use it for if you wanna ask it something or search. So before I hit search, I'm gonna do the same thing with the Google Lens. And now they're both searching and you can see just how much faster Google Lens was pulling up the results in a single click. Now, if you look, they are exactly identical for what they pulled up uh, for the most part. So that is a good start to both of these. So let's go ahead and swipe back from these and let's move this out of the way and let's put these OnePlus headphones here. So again, we'll take a picture here and we'll take a picture here and we'll search and you can see that was pretty quick and close on both with the Google Lens just ever slightly edging it out. Uh, but again, you're getting all the same results. If you wanna click on the first links or something, you'll see how it will actually load up. You got an image on the one we clicked here on the left side with Google Lens and the actual website for what was advertised on the iPhone. So go, let's get out of these really quick. But both did give us the correct results. So. Let us now try the motion controller RC. And let me actually put it up here to make it easier. And let's do the same thing here. And we'll search. And you can see both did give us correct responses though. Again, this one led us to a YouTube video first, while these led us to DJI's own website, Amazon, eBay, and all of that. So, not bad, three out of three for both, with the commonality being that Google Lens is just ever so slightly quicker. Now, for the new Google TV streamer 4K, let's go ahead and do this one last time. And we'll move this back up a little bit. There we go. And now we'll do this at the exact same time to submit. And you can see, yet again, Google Lens was just ever so slightly quicker. But I know this is a very small sample size as far as what this can do, but I am very impressed with both these devices giving us accurate results on all four of these tests. What's gonna be very interesting and cool is to really see down the road how this is gonna work with business times and operating hours, uh, and to see if Google Lens is capable of that. If it is already, leave a comment down below if you've ever tried that and you do know that answer for us. But that's it for this one, guys. Let us know what you think down below. Do you have a preference between either or? Thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.